Doctors say that a dangerous COVID symptom called silent hypoxia can be easily detected at home. People with silent hypoxia feel fine, even as their blood oxygen saturation drops and compromises organ function, potentially causing death. In recent weeks, there's been an increase in sudden COVID deaths that experts have linked to undetected hypoxia. Doctors say it's important for COVID patients to test their saturation levels regularly using a pulse oximeter. A reading below 95% could mean it's time to visit the hospital. The virus continues to spread and the number of sudden deaths from COVID keeps rising. Experts believe that in most of these cases, the victim was suffering from silent hypoxia. That's when the body loses oxygen, but there are no signs of a problem initially. The patient has no trouble breathing until they deteriorate rapidly without warning. The condition can only be detected with a device called a pulse oximeter. Generally speaking, normal blood oxygen saturation is in the ballpark of 97, 98, 99 percent. If it drops to 95 or 96 percent, that's not a reason to be too anxious because you might have been talking for too long or you might be out of breath after exercise. You can take a few deep breaths and see if your levels slowly go up. If they do, you should be all right. But if you test yourself and your blood oxygen is 94 percent or below and it doesn't get higher even after you are just your state, then I would suggest you go to a hospital as soon as possible. The physician says that when levels fall below 95% and won't go back up, it's time to seek urgent medical care. People whose levels are 92% and below may need oxygen therapy. Wu chang Tun, a pediatric emergency physician at Linko's Chang'e Memorial Hospital, says people with silent hypoxia may eventually start experiencing symptoms that prompt a hospital visit. Common symptoms are chest tightness, extreme difficulty breathing, shortness of breath, and taking breaths at least three times more often than normal. Other warning signs are lips and fingers that turn blue due to oxygen deprivation. They may already have obvious signs like skin and lips that have turned blue, or their faces turn pale, or they're experiencing wheezing, chest tightness, or low blood pressure. Usually, when these signs manifest, the patient's hypoxia is in the symptomatic stage, and it's time to go to a hospital right away. Physicians warn that silent hypoxia can kill. On Wednesday, the Central Epidemic Command Center sent 15,000 pulse oximeters to COVID-positive patients nationwide so that they can monitor their condition at home and get timely medical care.